Happy Monday, welcome, glad that you're with us. Today's quote comes from George Patton, General George Patton of the fame of World War II. Um, he, uh, what you may not know, I believe it was the 1912 Olympics. I'm not mistaken on the year, I know it was the Olympics. He was actually a participant in um, uh, the fencing, sorting uh, athletics. Um, really an interesting man in his own right. Mm -hmm and somebody that is worth the read and worth the study. But, you know, he was a very command and control guy. He was in charge, he was very direct. But today's quote is a little bit in opposition to that, that you might at least assume. Don't ever tell people how to do things. Tell them what to do and you'll be surprised by their ingenuity. Don't ever tell them how to do something, tell them what to do, and you'll be surprised by their ingenuity. So General Patton understood completely that if he tried to micromanage everything, nothing would ever get done. He, he had to create a culture within his command that said, I need this accomplished and let the soldier, whether they be a sergeant, a private, a captain, a lieutenant, a, a colonel, a warrant officer, doesn't matter. Let the soldier figure out how to get it done. Let the person doing the job get it accomplished. For those of you that are control freaks, this is hard. For those of you that are micromanagers, this is near impossible. Um, and for those of you that are bad micromanagers, not only is it impossible, but you won't even change the way you're doing it if it's not the best way to do it if somebody else comes up with the idea. I'm here to tell you something. You will limit your growth. You, you are stalled wherever you are. You're not going to go another step forward. Now, what's fascinating is According to the people we ask, no one is a micromanager. There's not a micromanager in the world. I have never heard someone say, yep, I'm a micromanager and I'm proud of it. I've had people admit that they're a bit of a control freak, which can sometimes also include micromanaging, but believe it or not, they're really two different things. The people to best decide if you're a micromanager are the people that work for you. And if, if you get told you're a micromanager, you need to take notice and you need to start making changes quickly because I'm here to tell you not only will you stall out in your growth but your entire department or your entire company or whatever it is you're leaving they are going to go no farther they are going to go no farther and you will be continually replacing people no one wants to work for a micromanager tell them what to do not how to do it they'll surprise you with their ingenuity if you'd like to talk more about this, because I know it can be very controversial for some, track me down. You know how to find me. Have a great week.